everybody. Damn, Peacock, the things I do to you. Uh, uh, uh. Body looking crazy. Peacock here, Merry Christmas Eve. Getting ready for my workout, gonna go on a bike ride. Gotta work my ass off because I'm about to eat my ass off later. Hey! Get the bag! I do appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right. All right. Bye bye. Hawaii. Why are we in Hawaii? Just saying. Yeah, well, we're here now. yours. Thanks. Surprise, surprise. I didn't know you guys were coming for Christmas. Oh my goodness. Look at you. Look how tall you are. And girls, you done got a little body there going now. And all this hair. Here, let me help you. Thanks. Well, your, uh, your tire's flat for starters. I think that's a... Uh... Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize that. I know who you are. You're that girl from that uh, Insta, Insta Frame yeah. reality show. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I love that show. Thanks. <laughs> Peacock. I knew that. I'm Tim. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you as well. Well, let me help you with this bike. Oh, thanks. Uh, Thank you. There you go. You might want to walk that to a pump you know, yeah. until you get it. I will. Switch that tire out. <laughs> you good? Yeah, thanks. Yeah. Cookie, cookie. Hi, Hi babe. Girl. How are you? I'm good, good to see you. Uh, what, Tim? So, yeah, thanks. I'll see you around. Yeah. He's actually on his way in. Oh, okay. Well, um, let's go on and go inside and get some food, girl. Good, because I'm hungry. Yeah, he's probably over there with that fast girl. What'd you say? Nothing. Come on. Come on. Thanks, for my change. Fancy phone. Hey! hey. <laughs> hey <mommy. laughs> oh, I still see you wearing those hooker shoes. <laughs> oh, don't start. <laughs> and too, too much jewelry. What do you think, Cookie? She looks fine to me. Hey, kids, I got something for you guys in the kitchen. Come on, follow me. Put the phone down. Well, if I'd known you were coming, I would have made other plans. I have something to do. No, you wouldn't have, but it's okay anyway. All right? Hey, Mama, where are you going? I have a late rehearsal, honey. Oh, can I go? Uh, well, you know what? I'm going to be far too busy, and I don't have anybody there to be looking after you, so I'm so sorry I can't take you this time. Maybe next time, okay? You sound just like my mom. Well, it's so nice to see you have such an understanding daughter. <laughs> Mama Stephanie, how you been? Never better. I'll see you for dinner. Oh, see you later, Mama. Gabby, hey. what's going on? Good to see you. Oh, how you doing? Mm, good. Good. Okay. Hey, working up with these bags, bro. Oh, I can help you take them back there. After you. Ashley, can you let him take them? I'm gonna talk to you for just a second. Okay. Okay. <laughs> good luck. <laughs> Over there. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Hey, 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 I can't uh -oh. stop running. Seriously. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, let them be kids. Man. Hey, oh. do you know that we could have been in Hawaii? This is all your fault. I know. I know you could have been in Hawaii. Mm -hmm. But if you went, you wouldn't have been around family. What, you ain't happy to see me? Of course I'm happy to see you. I'm always happy to see you. <laughs> all really? right, then. Okay, I'm just making sure, you know, all that complaining you're doing. Gosh. Look, it's going to be a good Christmas. It better be a good Christmas. <laughs> Hey y'all, Maddie's here. Hey, hey. Well, well, hey. well, look who it is. Oh, oh McDonald. Mm. How can I help you? 
for you to help me would require facial reconstruction. Given your age, this technology hasn't advanced that far yet. That's the best you got? Yeah, I've been working on that all morning. Yeah, where's some more? Mm. Daddy! Gabrielle! I didn't know you were coming. No, I Red didn't tell you? Oh, no, I wasn't trying to bore her with the specifics, yeah. you know. <laughs> How was the flight? Ah, Tim. Long. Yeah. I can't understand why all they have to offer is those little palm-sized <laughs> bags of peanuts, and then they want to upsell you with a little teeny yeah. bottle of liquor. I can get more out of a single pull in a cow teeth than they put in those bottles. <laughs> I know, trust me, it's a trip nowadays, man. Mm. Hey, but other than that, everything was cool? Ah, uh, well enough. I think I need some coffee or something oh. to settle my stomach. Right, get this man some coffee. It's all help. You know you shouldn't smoke alone. Who's there? I can smell that all the way over here. It smells good. Smoke, you want to join me? Sure. I didn't think you smoke. Yeah, well, I do a lot of things people think I wouldn't do. <laughs> you know, I'm starting my own reality show. Oh, for real? Mm-hmm. What's it about? Finding love. Mm. That shouldn't be too hard for you. Mm? You seem like a beautiful, smart, uh, sexy girl. You think so? Give me a shotgun. Shotgun. Oh, you know what? It's uh, <clears throat> it's not enough. Try it anyways. <laughs> Try it anyway. All right. Um. Dad. <coughs> oh. I need yeah, I'll be right. I'll be right there, son. Uh. <coughs> Here, 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 here. <coughs> you all right? You all right? You okay? Okay. Oh, come on, later. All right. Okay. If you want. All right. <coughs> what are my grandchildren up to in here? Huh? Hey, Papa. Hey, hey Papa. We're making s'mores. With sticks on a stove? What kind of California City Slicker setup is this? I don't get any idea of Smokey the Black Bear. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Nikki, what are you doing? Well, you scared the crap out of me. Well, someone left the back door open, so I thought I'd see myself in. Cool, girl. That's not my name. Whatever. I burned it. Oh, I can just have mine. <sighs> hey, um, kids, can I, can you give me the kitchen for a little bit so I can talk to everybody? Okay. Oh. Don't push me. Oh. Little girl, I didn't even know you were coming. I just told you that's not my name. My name is Nicola or Nikki. You can pick one. I'll call you whatever I want to call you. No, you won't. You want to walk? Hey, me? hey. Yo, we are not doing that right now, okay? Not this year. Gabby, you're the oldest. Please act like it. Nikki, respect your sister, okay? <sighs> All right, look. The reason I wanted to bring everybody together this Christmas is because I think Mama's really sick. Sick? Wait, 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 what you talking about sick? Because she hasn't said anything to me about being sick. Well, she wouldn't. She wouldn't say anything to anybody. That's why I'm telling you guys. Well, I thought her sinuses were just acting up, but now that I think about it, she has been coughing a lot more than she was before. Let's give Mama our dream Christmas. Well, you act like she's dying. Look. 
guys, let's just agree to keep this a secret. Agreed? Yeah, okay. Agreed. Agreed. All right. And we'll all link up after dinner. I mean, that's when Mama will be back. We have some last minute shopping to do, so. This coffee tastes like mud. Oh, well, I got this coat for you right here. Ha <laughs> 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 ha. Hey, old man, I... What are you doing? Um, looking for the love aid. The old love angel? Yes. Yo, who made that thing anyway? Your great grandpa made that. It's been sitting atop Carter Christmas trees for the last hundred years. Oh, wow. Uh, maybe you left it at home? No, 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 no. I swear I packed it. I took it, I put it, put it in my tote. Have you seen my tote? It's a red tote. It's mm -mm. A... Well, why don't you just call the airline, whatever airline you flew in on? That's a great idea. Why don't you call the airline format? Flew in on Western. Cool, I will. Listen, I got plans for us this Christmas. Oh, 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 oh. What, what, what kind of Christmas plans have you got? <laughs> Why are you gonna just laugh in my face like I can't come up with some good plans? <laughs> all, right, all, right, all, right, all right, look, just hear me all right. out, all right? Something a little less violent than our usual annual hunting trips on Christmas Day. I love those, but we're gonna reel it back a little bit. A little less all bloodshed. Right. All right, so this time, I was thinking, why don't we take the family hiking up to Penga Canyon? You know what I mean? Check out LA from a panoramic view. Boy, you got me to leave Mississippi on Christmas. All that good buck hunting to go hiking up some hill for a city view? <laughs> Next thing I know, you're gonna have me in a, in, in, in a Starbucks, sipping on laddies, talking about how our, our childhood was affected by cognitive dissonance. <laughs> Who talks about cognitive dissonance? No, 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 we're not gonna California. do that. No, and look, I got one more question for you. Hey. I'm very serious about this. What the hell is a laddie? A laddie is Starbucks, the, the, the milky coffee drink. <laughs> you trying to say a latte? <laughs> Man, your, wow. your, your mom and me, we lived in Los Angeles for five years before you were born, and, and, and they tried to get me listening to Beach Boys, and it, it was, I'd had Look, enough. It's not, gonna, you, it's not gonna be like that, all right? It's gonna be fun. Hunting is fun. It's what God made man to do. Well, by God, I agree with you. That's awesome. Right. But this time, let's just do something different. I get mm. it, all right? You, you, you a rough and tough wilderness kind of dude. I like it. But let's just do something only the fellas can do. I got it all planned out. Cool? I'm not wearing no fanny packs. Oh, man. We ain't gonna use no fanny pack. We, we're gonna be hiking. I got it. <laughs> Don't forget to call the airline. I won't. Alright, come on out. Come out. Come out wherever you are. Harry, I have worked on this show for 35 years, and you want to kill me off with a scorpion bite. It's a soap opera. What would you prefer to die from? I don't want to die. It's not me, it's the network. I have come to work every day that I was supposed to. I have never been late, and I have never asked for anything that wasn't due me. So I expect you to build me a storyline where I can meet my demise in a dignified way. There's no dignity in death. Besides, I can't. They want to go lighter. And what was that supposed to mean? Hold on a minute, Stephanie. I'm not trying to pull like the weight of race card here. What I'm trying to say is they want to go younger. Oh. Oh, oh, this is so embarrassing. I, I can't even speak on this. Because first, they made me a mother, and then they killed my daughter. Then they make me a surrogate. They give my son back to his mother. They have taken my character places that no other actor even dare to go. And you expect me to settle for some unceremonious death because they want to go younger? You owe me more than that. No, they owe me more than that. <coughs> Stephanie, it's Christmas <gasps> Eve. I only took this meeting with you because you mean so much to the show. Look, this is out of my hands now. 
Look, at, look, I'm just a whooping boy if that means anything. And if this new show model idea doesn't work out, yeah, I'll be coming over to your house and we'll be eating ice cream. We'll be getting fat together and laughing about all this. <coughs> I don't do ice cream. You know, that cough is really starting to scare me. Maybe you should get that checked out. Don't even worry about me. When's my last day? It's going to be the week of Easter, and you're going to get some time off. Why don't you spend it with the family? And in the end, we'll see what happens. In the words of Maya Angelou, I will rise. Is always a girl best friend. I say every day like Christmas, like say Nick be my boyfriend. Get everything my heart design, no need for Santa's me. I got it from 65. Oh my goodness. I am a huge fan of your work. It is an honor to be the new lead on set. I just hope to be half the actress you are. Are we still getting dinner after this, babe? Yeah, babe. Well, give me a few minutes and we'll go out. Yo, Cookie, let me get like one green bean. Get out of my kitchen. All right, like one scoop of mashed potatoes. Boy, bye. Two macaroni noodles, something. Hey, smell good in here. Mm-hmm. A country back house, if you ask me. Oh, my. Woo, woo, hello. Here you go, here you go. Come on, you, you cookie throwing down, you know that. Thank you. I, I know I'm, I'm about to throw up. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I don't wanna hear nothing come out of you. I, I ain't seen you cook nothing yet. Boiled water, something, <laughs> all right? Don't even, hey, cookie, don't pay him no mind. Boy, I ain't even thinking about your daddy, okay? He from the country. He think roadkill is a good meal. <laughs> <laughs> if I killed it. <laughs> yeah, yes, th this is Marshall Carter. A, a red bag, a small red bag, small red bag. Go to Canada during your show. All right, TJ and Amber, take those bags to your room, please. Here, let me add a bag. I'll take it to the room. Wrap the gift later. Thank you. That smells good, girl. Oh my God, that's amazing. You need some help? Well, I can always use some help, but if you think you're gonna get a little taste before everybody else, you better just march right out there and help them with that treat. I had to try. <laughs> oh wait, did you make the uh, dressing yet? I do it right now. Okay. Cookie, where do you want the banana pudding? In the refrigerator. These young girls, they don't even try. She don't know. They don't even try. I know. Oh, um, did you need some help with that dressing? I already talked to her about that. And? And what? What are you asking me? What you, you gonna, gonna do? Gonna you gonna 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 do me? I can do this myself. Thank you. You know what I was gonna tell you? Hmm. Look what I got for you, baby. <gasps> the spices from Mississippi. <laughs> you got that good, good. I got the good, good. Oh, right. Thank you. Thank you. That's right. Thank you. I know you do. You know she don't know what to do with that. Made that dry ass macaroni last year. You know what, little girl? I'm tired of you talking about macaroni. If you call me little girl, 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 you say you had some cooking share for me? Yeah. Can you go to the car and get that right now? Right now? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, and uh, you know what you gonna do? You gonna help me get this out the oven. Yeah. Look, you gotta know how to cook. We ain't gonna be able to I get you a cook, man. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hey, now, don't be smart with me. Help me get this out. I gotta do
bad wolf. No kiss. Later. I'm... What's wrong? I, I'm... I've been married to you for 37 years. I know when something's wrong with my wife. Now, what is it? I'm dying. We've talked about this. I've put things in place. Oh, this is my life, Marshall. I didn't expect it to end like this. Yeah. So, are you gonna tell them? It's not the right time. Okay. Mom, yeah. Dad, Cousin Cookie wanted me to let you guys know food is ready. Okay, yeah. we're gonna be there soon. All right. Mom, you okay? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. See you at dinner. Okay, sweet. <clears throat> Come here. Yeah. Um, um, is everything okay with you and Dad? Yes, yes, yes. Everything's fine. Yeah. Anyway, it's Christmas Eve. Let's go have some dinner. <laughs> In that case. You were in here. I knew it. Let me ask you something. Yeah. What did she have? No, no. Before you answer, tell the truth. She is. I tried to. I tried to tell you that. Who, what what are you did, talking about? What did she say? She said something like the end. Her and Daddy talked about not being able to go on, like at the end, like it's over. What I, is it? Don't say anything, all right? What do you mean, don't uh, say anything? Don't. Can I, please, stop. Just say Ma it. No. No. She, um... She has AAC. See? It's okay. Because I don't know what AAC is. Gabby. What is AAC? Acute abdominal cancer. She has cancer. Stop. So hold on. <laughs> you're trying to tell me that mama has cancer. That's what you're trying to say to me. Yes. Mama has cancer. Gabby, Gabby, please. Please keep this between us. Don't say nothing. Please. Can I tell you something? I came here. And I really thought that I was going to go on a Hawaiian vacation from here. I okay. really thought, stop. Just, I can't, I can't Gabby. right now. I can't. Gabby, don't say anything. I'm not playing. Gabby. Just don't. Okay. Father God, we thank you so much for bringing our family together. We ask that you bless this food, bless the hands that prepared this food, and let it be to the healing and nourishment of our bodies. And everyone at the table said, Amen. Amen. This looks so good. And it tastes good. <laughs> Make sure you get a little something to eat, okay? Extra, because you look like you're losing a little weight, baby. Nah, my weight's fine. Mom, I just uh, got some indigestion, that's all. I got it, Sean. Everybody, Merry Christmas Eve. Uh, oh, can I help you, Peacock? Oh, uh, I've got to tell you, I, I, and, uh, I invited her. You invited her? Yeah, uh, you know, it's cool what you're doing, dude. She fell off her bike, you know. Welcome, Peacock. Uh, somebody get the girl a plate. Yes, Papa.
Amber, give your mom the phone. No. Well, why should she have to give up her phone if she's only doing what her mother is doing? Give this phone. This is so unnecessary. You know what? When you have a child, you might be able to tell me how to raise mine, but until then, keep it to yourself. I'm surprised you're doing any kind of job seeing how you talk to people. Hey, you know, now. Look, I don't know what's going on with the both of you, but you need to stop now. Oh my gosh, here we go again. Oh, and I didn't choose to give you up, so bypass me with all that misdirected anger. Mom, you need to give this woman a hug or something. Hey, Gabby, I thought you got over that. She can't. It bothers her that she had our father all to herself. Our father? Really? Please, yes, daddy was there. But he was more into his agricultural class than anything else, okay? All right, all right, all right enough. None of you has any right to speak on how your mother and I decided to raise our family. We do us a little clarification. No, wait, wait. We don't know you nothing. I don't know who you think you are coming up in my house asking me to owe you something. All right, but maybe it might be nice to give them some reasoning for why we did what we did so they can stop all this bickering and nitpicking and carrying on. They're kids. I don't need to explain nothing to them. So you'd rather let them just keep going at each other so you can keep up appearances? Oh, please, Marshall. Okay, what am I supposed to tell them? How you couldn't make it in California? How you couldn't fit in? How you can't see past Mount Bayou, Mississippi? Wow. <coughs> and y'all really wonder why I never want to come back <coughs> no more. <coughs> I gotta go. How's mom? Getting it under control. All right. Is mom okay? I should be all right. Where's your sister? Oh, um, she took Tim and the kids to go have their own family dinner. She sort of just went to Hawaii since she can't stop talking about it. Nicola, stop. What did I do? It's not what you do, it's how you do it. You need to stop interfering with how she wants to raise Amber. But I'm not trying no to- No but. It's your sister's family, now stay out of it. You hear me? Can I help? Uh, yeah, yeah. Some of these still need hooks. Ouch. Oh, you all right? Let me put a little pressure on I'm you. Fine. So you sure? I, I, I'm fine. I'm mm fine. -hmm. <laughs> okay, all right. Just trying to help. It's funny. It uh, reminds me of the first time Dad showed me how to lace a fishing pole. I must have been, what, eight years old when he took me on my first fishing trip? And I sliced my finger wide open. I needed six stitches and everything. I remember thinking, Dad must be so mad that he has to miss the opening fishing season. That was my first thought as a kid, but 
he was actually just more concerned that I might get an infection. You know, he dropped everything, took me to the hospital, and left his most expensive fishing rod there with all his equipment. Well, did he get it back? Oh, yeah, he got it back. <laughs> Somebody saw it, recognized it as my dad's, and gave it to his cousin. And his cousin came in to the hospital and dropped it off in the back of a truck, so it was all cool. <clears throat> I don't really have that many memories of Daddy and me. Why do you think Mom and Dad didn't raise us together? Because they're crazy, that's why. I mean, don't you wonder how different our lives could have been and if we were all just raised together? The past is the past. The real question is, how different could everything be if we actually got along together as a family? That's what you should be asking. Why do you say that? Nikki, look at you. Look how you turned out. You are a beautiful, talented, award-winning actress. Yeah, I know, I know, don't be bashful. I mean, and you did it all on your own. Now, did you have to fly 3,000 miles away from home to do it? Yeah, you did, but you did it. You know what I mean, you got it done. Look at Gabby, Gabby is a beautiful, <laughs> no-nonsense, award-winning real estate agent in the South, in the South. Look at mom and dad, they're both amazing at what they do. I don't know, I just, I wish we would spend more time celebrating each other instead of worrying about how mom and dad raised us. Because the way I'm looking at it, they did a damn good job if you ask me. I guess. Nikki, I need you to promise me something, all right? Just promise me you'll try to stop fighting with Gabby so much about who was raised better. Okay. Seriously. I can make no promises, because if she brings it, I'm going to bring it, Mississippi style. OK, I, I get it. It's just the way I look at things these days is if you don't have anything else to give somebody, Give him your heart. Oh. Here, let me, let me help you with that. Because you're moving too slow. I was moving, I was doing better when I was by myself. You, know what? <laughs> you better watch yourself. <sighs> Wait, oh, I'm, I'm sorry I woke you. I, I, I thought the music would cover the sound. What is that? It's uh, gonna be a, a new love angel. <laughs> I, I, I can't find the original since we're gonna decorate the tree tonight. I thought I would try and make us a, a new one. Marshall, that don't quite look like a love angel to me. No, not, not, <laughs> uh, you know, I'm still working on it. Carve it some more, add a little color, and. and Wings and well, I don't know. Honey, honey, yeah. I'm sorry about what I said tonight. Well, I ain't paying you no never mind. Besides, it's, it's true. Boy from Wan Bayou, been there so long I can't see outside of it. I don't know that I want to. You, you come up out of Mountain Bayou, you made something of yourself. Well, at least I didn't forget where I came from. Town folks, some of them might say otherwise. What's that supposed to mean? Yeah. Some folks say you got high-minded. Forgot that you come from the first and only black family to own a mill in the whole state. Yeah, but what do you think? I think I, I know I married the prettiest, smartest, most talented woman in the whole world. Money didn't ruin you, it just 
brought something out of you other folks didn't know was in there, that's all. What kind of things? Yeah. All I know is that I am still married to that gal who sit by me while I caught more fish than I could carry. <laughs> The, the, the gal who wouldn't, who wouldn't let a, a Lawrence Albrecht take her to the prom. You, you know, he did have the hardest wheels in Bolivar County. The gal who, when I say, what the bees like, she say, Honey. You're my honey. I miss the old us. I do too. Why don't you come back home with me? Mom, buy you. Oh, Be Marshall. like old times. Oh, Marshall is just probably as dead there as it was when I left. And what am I gonna do? Just sit in the rocking chair and, and eat pickles pork, pickles pig feet till I die of a heart disease. <laughs> Stephanie, you still don't get it. But you think cause you got a big fancy acting career, got a big fancy house and cars and clothes, that you're a better woman for that? You are the laughing stock of Mon Bayou. Yes, we, we are simple, hard-working, easy-living folk, and you are out here struggling just to make a good appearance. What do, what do they say? They, they say, fake it till you make it. Well, you made it. Okay, you know what now? You need to hold up on this, Marshall. I'm not gonna stop until I'm finished saying what needs to be said. You are the most successful person ever to come out of Mont Bayou. Boulevard County, as a matter of fact. If you ever stop to think about why they have never honored you, hell, they never even gave you the key to the city because they don't like you. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have said that. Sorry. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, that was... No. That was Looks nice. Like Christmas in here. Red did most of it. Mm. He's really trying to make this one something special. As we all should. Time and tools, that's the best I can do. <laughs> yes. Daddy, that isn't gonna work. That's <gasps> all we got. Well, what is it? Daddy made some janky love angel. He lost the other one. I didn't lose it. I just can't remember where I left it. <laughs> I get that. Well, maybe you left it at our house. No, I don't believe so. Can I see it? Why? I just want to admire your work. Yes. Oh, look at that. Wow. You didn't have my tools. Yeah. Is it there? Mm -hmm. Oh, Gabrielle! You... It makes me feel better. Look at the burn now, though. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to be right back. <laughs> I just got to get this lip gloss. Yeah. <laughs> It's very relaxing. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Mm. 
You know, we oh. should go to my place. We don't oh. have to hide over there. Ooh. Uh, I'm kind of doing the family thing, you know? <clears throat> I'll tell you what. We can have a toast to new beginnings. <laughs> we don't have any liquor. We could do it later when all the babies and mm. baby mamas are asleep. I, I, I gotta tell you something. I don't wanna... I don't wanna lead you on. Tim. Yeah, yeah. I can tell a man that's headed for divorce. You can bring the heat when I'm feeling cold. We gon' have a California Christmas. It's just you and me, let's make this house a home. California, California Christmas. Thing I have to happen. I can lose everything except you. Except you. Cause you're the only thing that I wanted. You can have me really going all in. I feel in love and it's calling. Girl, you just so flawless. I wanna wake up to you in the morning. Even if snow ain't falling, falling. Okay, okay, all right, so the only thing I remember is when Dad saw the alligator, he actually picked me up like a football. I mean, took off running towards the truck, and I just, I just knew at some point he was gonna drop me. But he did, he, he actually tripped. tripped. I, I did not drop you. Uh, okay, that, 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 that old man, that's your story. Can I tell my story? <laughs> Please, tell, right. tell my story. Okay, so maybe he doesn't drop me. This dude does something worse. He literally picks me up, tosses me 50, about 50 feet into the truck. And that's not the worst of it, it gets better. No, he true. jumps into the truck and lands on my chest with his knees. Am I lying? He's no, that's not true. <laughs> that is exactly true. No, that's not true. And I didn't know who was in more danger, you know what I'm saying? That me from the alligator or me from my dad trying to save me. <laughs> Papa, is that true? No, no, look. The, that the alligator jumped up after us, that's true. Mm -hmm. That your uncle ended up in the flatbed of the truck is true. That I threw him in there, that, that, that's a story. <laughs> 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 okay. Hey, okay, but answer this though. Yes or no, did you land on my chest? I don't recall. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know what? If you're gonna be here with your family, be here with your family. Stop, I wasn't bothering anyone. You're bothering me, that's who you're bothering. Whoa, 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 whoa. what's going on here? Never seen you two like this before. Amber was suspended from school. Mom, don't. What? She was suspended for 10 days for kissing a boy in the boys' locker room. Gabriella, was that necessary? Well, while you're at it, why don't you tell everyone how you and dad have been separated since last summer? I never knew a woman could be so cruel to her own daughter. Well, I guess that's why Tim spends all his time in the backyard getting high. Because he's happily married to an unhappy woman. I'm hungry. <laughs> you know what? Hold this. Hold that. You got something to say? Okay, all right, that's my time. That is my time. Uh, Dad, you take me home? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna tell. Let me have a minute with your sister. So, we're not gonna put the love angel on the tree? Come on, babe. Clearly, it's not the time. What's going on? I knew mom was gonna be extra. No, 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 you are not being fair. She's going through a very difficult time. You have no idea what's going on with her. She, she didn't expect this. 
didn't expect to be losing everything and you can't expect to be happy at a time like this. You go ahead and take red. I'm gonna wrap some presents, okay? Right, I don't know what's going on with you and Tim, but he's been a good man and a, and a great husband. So I hope you two can work it out. If you can't forgive family, who can you forgive? Get out. <laughs> we all gotta work it out. She hates me. Sorry, Daddy. I just felt like Mommy was trying to cause a scene on purpose. I I get it. Uh, I'm the one who should be saying sorry. Are you ever gonna come back home? It's a good question. Um, time will tell. Amber, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Come here, man. Listen. Your mother and father, we love each other very much, okay? We're just experiencing something they call growing pains. You know, that's what families do. They have their ups and downs, but it doesn't mean that we have to stay down. When we get back home, can I go live with you? Me too. We spend most of our time with you anyways. You pick us up from school, practice, our friend's house, so I Is mean- Is your mother gonna go for that? When she was our age, she lived with her father, so I don't see a reason why not. Okay, I'll tell you what. <clears throat> if your mother and I are not back together by the summer, then we'll all sit down as a family and we will discuss it, all right? I'm so angry since you've been gone. Look, everything is gonna work out for the best, all right? I promise. I will work harder, all right? Bring it in, bring it in. Mm. <laughs> these a little better. Why? So you can take all the credit? You wrap it. You mind not throwing things at me? You mean like I'm throwing away my marriage? Yeah. Right. I'm not taking all the blame. I wasn't the one doing the cheating. I did not cheat. It was a picture. It was a picture of a girl in a bathing suit in your phone. My frat brother sent it to me. It was a joke it for the 10th time. It wasn't funny. <sighs> now what? You need that too? You're gonna lose this, you understand that? Oh. Yeah, I mean, losing you? Ooh, scary. That's just great, Gabby. Can I ask you something? Why, why do you sabotage the people you love? Huh? What is that? Is that some sort of a uh, redemptive thing you need to kind of make you feel better about yourself? Huh? Pushing the people away from you that love you? Why do you do that? Do you even know why you do that? I'm not a bad mother. You're not a bad mother. Did I say you were a bad mother? That's what you implied. You push people away, you push yourself away. I didn't think I'd get a straight answer.
Hey, now you know you don't need to be spending time with nobody but your wife. How do you know where I'm going? Because I know things. What you? Hey, you know that's my last one. You better bring me some back. Tim. I thought you was Tim. Do I look like Tim? You don't look like Tim. I was hoping you was Tim. Well, where's Tim? Really? Really. What, what, what you want, Marshall? Between smoking all that weed and cleaning chemicals, I think you fried your brain. Look, Marshall, I just want to thank you for all the things you've been doing for the family. I really appreciate it, all right? Why are you being so nice? Oh, you trying to help Stephanie collect that insurance? Let me just get this out, all right? With Stephanie's career just going down the drain and everything, I just knew some changes was gonna be coming around the corner. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for being such a good friend to my wife. Even if it did turn out to be the worst cousin I ever had. Well, you know, you're not so bad yourself. <laughs> I'm lying. <laughs> no, I'm just bullshitting you, right? You just bullshitting. Get some sleep. Big day tomorrow. Come on, Tim. Hey, Dad, what's up? Morning, son. What time you want me to come get you? Yeah, yeah, I, uh, I'll catch an Uber over there as soon as I wake up. Are you sure? Your sister and them cook breakfast, and Cookie's about to suck up the whole kitchen, so you better hurry if you want some. I'll, um, I'll be over there as soon as I finish wrapping these gifts, all right? Merry Christmas, Red. Merry Christmas, Red. Tell everybody I say Merry Christmas, all right? Red says Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> Are we still going on that hike? Yeah, yeah, no, um, <clears throat> we're still going. I, I, uh, I'll send you guys the, the information so you guys can drive there yourselves. It's real easy to get to. You sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. I'll be over there. All right, then. I'll see you in a bit. All right. I love you, Dad. Bye. Papa, we're still going on our hiking trip, right? You bet we are. Where's Tim? Is he still hiking? <gasps> what? Nothing? Girl, go get something to eat. Man, Hey guys, 
want to show you my Christmas gift to myself. Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> Say hi, baby. Don't um, be shy. Hi. Merry Christmas. <laughs> He's cute. I know it, Rich, too. <laughs> Here, have some more. <laughs> yeah, well, did you tell them I'm in Los Angeles? Yes. Okay, hold on. You're telling me he still refuses to sign the documents. No, it doesn't make sense for me to come back to Mississippi. I'm here. He acts like he still owns this land. I mean, I'm, I don't understand. Why are we at Uncle Red's house? Because what about Disneyland? I, look, we have plenty of time for Disneyland, okay? It's the busiest day of the year. Calm down. I'm sorry. What? Okay, you know what? Just just tell him to text me. I, you know, I'm going to text him myself, okay? I'm going to get this straight. And I'm really sorry to snap at you and put you in the middle of this on Christmas. Okay, I'm sorry. Merry Christmas, Danielle. All right. Bye. You know what? Yeah. You see I'm on the phone, right? You know what? I, I have to deal with you. Sit right here. I'm going to be right back because I got something for you. Hey! Hey! Okay. Yeah, that's good. Hey! Not now, I'm not dressed. Look, I don't care if you're getting dressed. Open the door. What, uh, what are you talking about? I'm good, all right? Look, I'll, I'll see you at Mama's house. <sighs> okay, you, now you know I will bust out a window, right? You know that. I suggest you open the door. Uncle Red doesn't want to be bothered. Leave him alone. And you go back to the car. Thank you. Got it all I need. Go ahead. Did you? You know I will climb through this window. I got on fly flats too. You better open up. Hey! You're gonna have to tell them eventually. Uh, did you hang up on me? Hey! Not on Christmas. I know you hear me. Hello? This is how high is this? I can get Oh my god, Trisha, what happened? That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, we're supposed to go to Disneyland today. I don't know, we'll see. Hello? Judge Effingham, how are you? Yeah, well, Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah, no, everything is just fine. And I'm actually glad you called. Um, I wanted to let you know I really need to get those contracts signed. second I just want to pull over really quickly so I can focus thank you yeah my name is Amber and I'm rolling down the street with my mom <sighs> hi I'm back Space yeah Space <laughs> no I would I would love to meet with a new client absolutely yes you know what I can um, be there by morning in order to do that I'm gonna have to leave tonight though No, absolutely. It's absolutely worth it. Of course. Yes, I think it's an amazing opportunity. I really appreciate that. Okay. I will, uh, I'll see you then. All right, thanks. Uh, Amber, I am going to have to postpone Disneyland. What? That's not fair. You promised me we were going to go. What do you... <laughs> Listen to me. We all have to make sacrifices, and I'm making a sacrifice, so you'll understand when you get older. You never make sacrifices for me, though. 
I'm doing that right now. Don't you understand that? I'm making sacrifices for you as we speak. Hey! Amber! Amber! I'm not. I can't keep up. Yes, you can. Come on, young man. I'm going to uh, check on Dad. Hi, Tim. I'm sorry I got your voicemail. I um, hope you check this because I am looking to talk to Amber. So um, let me know if you talk to her or see her, please. Call me straight back on my phone. All right, thanks. Nikki, um, I just wanted to see if you've seen Amber. So please call me back or text me back if you have. Okay? All right, thanks. Are you okay? Hey, Red, it's Gabby. Um, I came by there earlier. Can you please, please call me back? I really hoped you'd answer your phone. I, I need to talk to you. So call me back right away, okay? Thanks. Gabby called me, but I can't get no reception. She called you? I don't think so. Excuse me, excuse me. Have you, uh, have you seen this girl? Anywhere? Uh, I haven't. Are you sure? Can you take another look, please? No, I'm sorry. Okay. Thank I'm you. Sorry. Need to take a break. Where's TJ? I thought it was with you. No. TJ! TJ? Excuse me, excuse me. Have you uh, have you seen this girl anywhere around here? No, sorry. Are you sure? Can you just take one more look, please? Okay. Thank you. DJ. DJ. Boo! Ah! Ah! I was such a pretty baby. I was beautiful. You, you, you're, you are adorable. Look, you had a big head, but you are so cute. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Have you talked to Amber? No, why? Have you seen her? Oh, no, I, I'm just, I just, I haven't talked to her, so I just, uh, I just was checking in with you. Okay, well, just, just let me know if you do, okay? Oh, what happened to you? Why are you laying on the ground, boy? Oh, what? Oh, TJ. Okay, stop all that hollering. It's not that bad. It's not broke. What's the matter? Why are you looking so sad? It's going to be fine. It's just a little sprain. I'll show you how to do a little first aid, okay? Here you go. There you go. Let it go. Let it go. <coughs> let it go. Just let it out. Uh, uh, all right. You okay? Yeah. Mm 
Okay, I'm so sorry I got okay. you earlier. It's okay, it's okay. Wash, I got it right out. It's all about you. Don't worry about me. I'm here for you. You sure you're all right? Yeah, I'm good. Look, I want you to take this before you go to bed, okay? Mm -hmm. This is gonna boost your immune system. This is for your nausea so you don't throw up. Right. You got it? Yeah, I'm good. Will you call me if you need something? Absol yes, absolutely. Thank you. Okay. You all right? Yeah. You gonna be okay? Yeah, yeah. Excuse me. I was trying to tell you Amber's missing. No, I could... I know you heard... Thank you. What is this? What is this? It's, um... Hey, what is this? I, um... Why? I have pancreatic cancer. Yeah. I don't understand. Come on, you understand. No, I don't understand. Yes, you do. You know what it means? It's gonna I'm be not okay, afraid. Though, right? It's, you can, it's gonna be fine, though, right? It it's gonna, you can get better. It's gonna be okay because I made my peace with God and I know where I'm going. It's all over. But I don't want you to know that I tried. I want you to know that I fought. I fought so hard. Oh my God. But I'm tired. I'm tired, okay? I tried. I can't, I can't do it anymore. Oh my God. It's gonna be all right. I put myself on the donors list, all right? Okay. Oh, I know you don't want to hear that. I know I that's not what I you want to hear. But listen to me, listen to me. I don't want to talk about it's it. It's we have to talk about it now. We gotta talk about it now. Please. I wanna know that before I go, I left something and I gave something that mattered. Okay? <laughs> so it's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right. Yes, it is. Please. Don't do Please that. Don't say that. Don't, don't do that. Please don't do say that. that. Please don't say that. Please. Hey. Please. Hey. Okay. It's gonna be all right. Okay. Okay. I love you. I love you. I love, I love you. you. Gabriella, courtesy call, let you know everything's all right. Hey, do you have um, Amber? Amber? Where's Amber? It's your husband. He twisted his ankle a little bit, but he's crying, acting like he broke his leg. But nothing, really. It's going to be fine. Th okay, um... I'll explain it all to you later. Bye. Bye. <sighs> what was... Tim sprained his ankle. What? Thank you. What do you want? Snapchat. Oh, let's take one. Oh, that looks cute. I look good. Cute. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna call your mom real quick. Hi. <sighs> oh my God. <sighs> Hello? Hey. Hey, Mickey. Do you have Amber? I'm with Amber right now, and we're actually gonna go to Disneyland. <laughs> we're going to Disney, okay. All right. So we'll just see you guys back at the house later. Okay. I oh, hope she wants to talk to you. You know what, Gabriella? Um, she's cool. I'll take care of it. Okay. <laughs> okay. They found her. They found her, They're right? on their way to Disney. Oh, of course. Oh, my God. I'm Thank sorry. God. Um, <clears throat> what were you going to tell me? Hmm? You were going to tell me something. 
you know what? It's not even important no more. They, they found Amber. That's what matters, all right? They did, okay. <laughs> Listen, do you need to lay down or something? No, I actually feel a little bit better for a second. <laughs> I'm okay. Can I lay down? Yes, you can. Make yourself at home. You already did that. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. Okay, that's the music. Mm hmm. Hold on. Go ahead. I'm on the move. I'm on the move. Always running like I can't stop, but I'm missing you. But I'm missing you. And girl, every day you're in my thoughts. I'm telling the truth. Merry Christmas. Is uh, Marshall Carter available? Well, Merry Christmas. I'm his wife. May I help you? Uh, yes. Uh, just delivering his bag here for the airline. Oh, thank you. Oh, Marcus, you mind giving a sign sure. here? Sure. Merry Christmas, Peacock. How can I help you? Um, something's wrong with my toilet, and I was hoping that Tim can come over and help me with it. Oh, I think Tim is indisposed at this time. But um, I'm sure this young man would be happy to help you. Well, I don't mind, and I am off. And it would make me a very happy man to help the uh, most famous girl I've met. I was a million follower. <laughs> Come on. Then thank me later. <laughs> so what kind of benefits you got? No copay on dental. Walking out of nobody life anytime soon. Huh? When are we gonna open our When are we gonna open our Christmas presents? You wanna come help me decorate some Christmas cookies? Can I have some? You know you can. Come on. Yeah. Your bag arrived. Oh, yeah. Not here. Are you still looking for that love angel? Yes. Oh, Marshall. Everything we need, we have right here. I, I, um, uh, tripped on a rock. Dang, man. <clears throat> hey, I'm sorry I couldn't make it. I know that view had to be crazy. It was. <laughs> <laughs> man, you good? You all right? Yeah, I'm good, man. Thanks. All right, man. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Um, you got a minute? Yeah, I do, but somebody's been sending me video messages all day, so let me just check this out really quickly first. Video messages? Yeah. Um... I have something I want to tell you. Okay, just, just give me one second. First, I don't understand what's first, can I? You can, but I actually have something to tell you first. I lost Amber. No, I didn't lose Amber. You lost Amber? Nope, I didn't lose Amber. Amber ran away, but she's back now. She's with Nikki, she's safe. And I needed to get that out 
to tell you right now. But she's okay. I lost her. You lost her. Okay. Um, anyway, so Amber's good. She's good. Good. Okay. Now, um, <clears throat> I have something that I want to tell you that I don't, um, I don't think you're gonna like, but I wanted to tell you instead of you. Um, Why don't you just get to it? Just get to it. Okay. Just um, get to it. So, um, I had to. Uh, I was smoking the other day, and I, and I know you don't. I know you don't. I know how much you hate for me to smoke, but I had to call my nurse because you know. Okay, you know what? You know well, I'll just get to the part where you messed up right. and you just need to skip to the end. Just skip to the end. Okay. Um, I was at Peacock's. Okay, and um, she she um, she is the girl from the Insta Frame. Uh, reality show okay and she did this live chat video and I'm drunk I had a couple drinks and she was all over me doing crazy stuff to me and did you sleep with her? no no I did not sleep with her okay I promise are I, you I, sure I, I would, you no I would not disrespect you like that like, like just, that you wouldn't disrespect me like that but in another way you might disrespect me you were there you were smoking probably drinking I was calming my nerves disrespectful but you wouldn't sleep with her Okay, one more thing. Oh, um, there's more. Okay. The picture. Um, what? The, there's a picture? It's just a picture, okay? Nothing happened. Uh, Daddy, so what happened? Hang on. Hey, I, Baby, you know what? Don't you ever run away from me like that again. Do you know that you scared the daylights out of me? I was scared to death. Are you understanding yeah. what I'm saying to you? Gabby, she's home now, okay? Well, I'm glad you're home. Your mom is glad you're home. So mm -hmm. why don't you go get ready for dinner, okay? Thank you. Kevin. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm really sorry. That's all I wanted to tell you. That's all she gonna do? She damn near broke my windows earlier. And all of a sudden, she wanna be reasonable. <laughs> Come in. Mom, Dad, can I talk to you guys in the living room for a little bit? Sure. Huh. Hey guys. Hey. I, I know I made a big deal that everybody come together this Christmas. Because I made it seem like someone was was dying. Yeah, mom. What? what? Yeah, He's Red not? Red told all of us that you were dying. I'm dying on the show. It's embarrassing, but they're killing me off the show. I'm dying on the show. I'm not dying. So why would you even? No, it's just a bad case of bronchitis. I'm fine. I'm dying. Okay. It's me. What? You? I'm dying. Guys, I'm dying. Um, a while ago, the doctors diagnosed me with pancreatic cancer. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't know how to tell you guys. I, I didn't know. Please, please forgive me, Mom. I'm sorry. 
you know I would never wish sickness on you. I wasn't strong enough to tell y'all, and I didn't, I didn't know how to tell you, so I put it on the strongest person I know, and that's my mom. You know, Levin, we're gonna support him. We're gonna be here for him. That's what we're gonna do. And we're gonna make this Christmas our dream Christmas. Mm -hmm. Uncle Red. Yeah, what's up, man? If you're gonna die, you're gonna have to open this gift for me. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Well, go on and open it. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, this is, hey, this is, thank you. Thank you. So let's not worry about tomorrow. We got each other right now. You just want that bow stick, don't you? Oh yeah, it was nice but not very nice. Is it illegal if I date him? Yeah. Damn, I wish I had that lovely. I have it. You do? It's in my bag. Well, go get it. Attention family, we have something we want to tell you. All right. Your papa and I have decided that after the show ends, we are gonna to move to Jackson. Jackson what? Mississippi. You know, I'm a Mississippian woman, born and raised. Um, what are you gonna do in Jackson? Well, besides spend a lot of time with my granddaughter and my grandson, I've had, and you, sweetie, I've had a dream of opening up a theater. Done. Done. What's wrong with her? Probably saw her own reflection and realized it's too late to do anything about it. Stop <laughs> that. Please complain. Here it is. Hey. Now how did you get it? You gave it to me last Christmas. <laughs> Told me it's with my mind. Is your sister here? I have something to say to her. 
First off, you were not speaking to my sister. And second, don't you bring your scrawny ass around here anymore, you homewrecker. I saw the video. Good, that's what I came here to talk to her about. This is Marlon, my boyfriend. He saw the tape, and I was trying to explain to him that Tim wasn't my man. Oh no, Tim is not her man. He is my sister's husband. See, I told you I don't do married men. Hey, sorry to bother you, you know what I'm saying? Merry Christmas. We actually were just coming by because we figured we'd stop over here and get some cooks to cook it. Now, can we go turn up for Christmas? <laughs> yes, we can. Excuse me, everyone, near and far. I would like to introduce you to my best friend, my youngest and cutest cousin, and the backbone of this family, Miss Sharice Carter. Woo! I didn't have time to wrap it. But what's this? Open it. I, I don't, I don't get this. <laughs> we all got together and got you some land in Jackson. It was no easy task, but we got you 10 acres in the city. Mm -hmm. Well, what am I supposed to do with all this land? <laughs> Live on it. Marshall and I are going to build you a house. Furnished. Not everything, but you're going to have to buy some <laughs> of the stuff. <laughs> Cousin Cookie, you don't like it? I feel like y'all trying to get rid of me. What? No. Cookie, we love you, okay? You're our family and we want to do this for you, all right? Besides, I mean, who's gonna look after everybody when I'm gone? We love you, okay? Okay, okay, all right, all right, hey, en enough, man. Hey, hey, somebody turn that music back up. <laughs> Amber, you got it? Mm -hmm. All right. Dad? Uh -oh. Come on. Uh -oh, let's make room. Come on. Come on. Now put your damn shoes on. Come on, man. Put your damn shoes on. How's it going? Oh, yeah, yeah. Now put your damn shoes on. Put your right here. Hey, okay, put okay. your grown folks on. Now slide to the right. Now slide to the left. Now slide to the right. Now slide to the left. Now boogie, you give up, son. I know. Hey, strong, Carter Man. I love you, son. Thank you. Thanks, strong, Carter Man. Go down. <laughs> Hey, sis. Hey! Yeah, um, I was just calling to tell you that I just booked this major role. What? Um, and I have to play a young mom, and I was kind of hoping you could give me some advice. Yeah, I really like that. Cool. Oh, and Nicola? I love you. I love you, too. You're so amazing. Bring out the best in me. Though this life is one big puzzle, you're the perfect centerpiece. You're so amazing. You're so right on time. When my days are full of darkness, on my path you 
Just like Uncle Red. Keep on amazing me. Keep on, keep on, keep on amazing me. Keep on amazing me. Keep on amazing me. Keep on. You're so amazing. I know that we all make mistakes. Clearly, I've made some. You've made some. But we have to forgive family. And you're my family. You're so amazing. You're like no one else. It's your love that always lives me when nobody else can help. Keep on amazing me. Keep on amazing me. Keep on amazing me. Keep on. Stephanie, I cannot imagine the pain you and your family are going through. I know there is now a void that can never be filled. Every time you fill that void, think of Elizabeth Noel Rhodes, a beautiful 10-year-old girl that now has a chance at life because of your son. Marshall Carter Jr. gave my family the heart to keep fighting when we had nothing left. He will always be a symbol of hope to a family that almost lost faith. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. The roads. Take a break for some supper, honey. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, that looks good, sweetie. All right. Good old pickles, pig feet, huh? I love you. I love you too. We did good. Yes. We're home. We're home. Baby, can you be my gift? My gift. Had you on my wish list, you know what it is, is I just want to kiss on ya, baby, I'm on this even if snow ain't falling, falling, no one should be alone for the holiday, I just want to see it fade. Make this house a home California, California, Christmas Thing I have to have I can lose everything except you Except you Cause you're the only thing that I wanted You can have me really going all in I feel in love and it's calling Girl, you just so flawless I wanna wake up to you in the morning Even if snow ain't falling, falling No one should be alone for the holidays I just wanna see a face Maybe we can decorate This house a home. Got 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 a home.